Advocates for Portland renters are pushing for more protections, this time against what they call harassing behavior by landlords. Fox 12 Simon Gutierrez explains what sort of things tenants have had to endure and whether Portland City Councilors are willing to take action. It's a story that's all new at 6. Tenants surveyed by Portland Tenants United, a group that lobbies for tenants' rights, say they've experienced a variety of harassing behaviors, from excessive inspections to verbal bullying. At the same time, they've felt powerless to do anything about it. When we met Lindsay Mena, she was in the process of moving out of her southeast Portland apartment, and not by choice. I'm a single mom. I'm a long-term tenant. I've always paid rent on time. I haven't caused any property damage or... I've taken good care of their property, and this is what's happened. Mena says she's rented from the same landlord for more than five years with no issues until just recently when her landlord suddenly started over-communicating and demanding she pay for repairs she asked them to make. It came to a head with a face-to-face -face confrontation. You know when someone comes to your door and you're like, oh, come on in, you kind of step back and like allow them space to come through the doorway. Well, I hadn't really done that, and she kind of came in past me anyway, like very close to me and then got in my face, like, you know, within a few inches, like yelling at me and I was just shaking. Shortly after that, Mina says she got an eviction notice. She got a lawyer to fight it and ended up settling out of court, agreeing to move out in exchange for two months rent free. It's caused me so much anxiety and stress and um, my mental health has really suffered. According to Portland Tenants United, out of 200 tenants surveyed in 2021, 41% experienced conflict with their landlord or manager. 30% reported experiencing harassment. What we see a lot of is landlords who file evictions that don't have legal standing. We see landlords that uh, violate the right of entry. Lots of cases of landlords that yell at tenants, threaten tenants, sometimes physically assault tenants. PTU has pushed Housing Commissioner Carmen Rubio to draft a city ordinance that directly addresses landlord harassment. Rubio's staff says they'll be reviewing the issue. Mena, for one, hopes the city is able to put together some kind of ordinance that offers tenants more protection. We're at a disadvantage. There's, there's a power imbalance between landlord and tenant. Like, and there's really no recourse available to tenants when landlords abuse their power. Portland Tenants United says that they'd like to see a city ordinance that establishes a city-run complaint process for tenants and some kind of city intervention on their behalf if there's a conflict with landlords. Right now, the only recourse for tenants complaining of harassment is small claims court or an attorney. I'm Simon Gutierrez, Fox 12 Oregon.